Hey friends, what is up? It is Maisie with Barbecue by Maisie. If you are new here, does that mean you're looking at a Brunswick? I see you. And if you're coming back, I sure do appreciate you. All right, as promised, I'm doing a little series, doing a little in-depth look at all of the smokers and grills that I have. And this video is going to be all about the Pit Boss Brunswick. Oh, she's a fine piece. She's real fine. I really like her. You can pick this old girl up at your local Walmart for about $597. It is a Walmart exclusive, 1,160 square inches of cooking space, four racks, <sighs> four racks, 98 pound hopper capacity. <laughs> okay. That's like almost a hundred. Wi-Fi bluetooth capable and the good news is pit boss updated their app recently and it works like a dream so that means you can monitor your smoker temperature your meat temperature with the probes that are provided could it get much easier than that no i think not one feature i really do love about this smoker each level has these vents where smoke is coming up and through each vent at each level so the smoke is being distributed evenly oh it's nice what i mostly use this smoker for is a larger longer cook so like larger pieces of meat does really well in there because you can get the meat up and away from the firebox which is located at the very bottom of the smoker as opposed to something like the navigator where you got the firebox right in the middle and then the two sides where you're trying to decide all right where do i put my meat I do like the Brunswick where you can get your meat up higher. I don't know. It just, it cooks a brisket, a pork butt, ribs like a dream. And I do have several videos of me cooking those specific meats on the Brunswick. I'll do my best to link all of that for you so you don't have to go searching. Anyways, let's dive in and take a look at the smoker. Up here, we got our little uh, controller situation, if you will. It comes with probes that I actually haven't used because I don't really care to monitor the temperature of my meat throughout the entire cook. I have found that it's just not necessary for me. They will also show up on the app. It also has a light, so if you're doing some cooking in the dark, you can turn on your light really easy. The temperature can be set in 10 degree increments. If I'm remembering correctly, it goes from 150 to 450. Um, so this does awesome for jerky. Shout out to myself because I have a video on that as well. We were just getting her opened up after a long, horrible winter. And I didn't clean it at the end of the fall. And it simply was too cold for your girl. I wanted to show you these events I was talking about. You see, right? there oh that's what i'm talking about each level has these vents that the smoke is coming out of see real nice one thing to note about the racks is you cannot move them they have to be in these spots but i mean there's a lot of space between each one and you can really fit a lot of meat in there you know what i'm saying here at the bottom we have the ash clean out which is nice you just pull that right out dump the ashes the fire pot is down here enclosed in here now the curiosity in me wants to open this and see what's in there and i think i'm going to one of these days and i'll video so we can all see together what is in there because i feel like i want to clean in there i just get that feeling this is your water pan this is your drip tray somebody come clean this would you your drippings go to the back and they roll down a tray back there and it dumps into the back i will show you that this is your hopper for your pellets so if you're running out of pellets in this thing that's just inexcusable all right and then down here is the grease tray that's where all your grease is going and it just pulls out simple here is your pellet door if you want to change the flavor of pellets that's where you do that so hopefully i covered most of your questions if i forgot something or left something out which i probably did 
be sure to leave me a comment and I'll do my best to get to those. Stay tuned for the next video, which is going to be the Navigator. <laughs> She's a real beauty as well. Appreciate you hanging out with me today. As always, you guys are the absolute best. Until next time, ta-ta for now. <laughs>